August 16th, 2014. Earthquakes have been noticeably absent during the lower earthquake index period from suspiciousobservers.org. Since the index began falling days ago, we've yet to have a six-pointer. In fact, the last such quake was a whole week ago in Japan. Average is three magnitude six or higher earthquakes per week. But the situation is about to change. No coronal holes present facing Earth, but we can see some coming in. The magnetic connectivity chart at ISWA shows no holes facing Earth, but the colorful regions a few days away herald a return of increased Earth-facing magnetic force. It's a bit of a culmination with Jupiter conjoining Venus in just two days, same time as the coronal holes arrive, followed just 36 hours later by the geocentric opposition of Mercury and Neptune. While the planetary geometry and coronal holes approach, so does a CME. That filament we saw erupting this morning is set to impact Earth right in that window, and nobody disagrees about the geo-effectiveness of the eruption. Auroras are highly likely as well. On top of that, one of the Uyen quake factors is a peak or trough of sunspot numbers, and we are about to have a peak. If we can look just a week ahead of that, we'll watch Saturn and Mars conjoin geocentrically, followed by the opposition of Neptune and the Sun. The larger watch is for the coming days. This period of low seismic activity is poised to end. Be safe, everyone.